this is my call. We are not a stream of creative. Today, people, is today is Wednesday, June 27, 2018. If we are gonna be continue painting boom, the enforcer, enforcer from the breakers, you know, that's what we do every single Wednesday. We take uh, some kind of art. We are doing, you know, we are doing a video game over here. We are doing a, a low break art book. So we take some of those pieces of stuff, the content we are we are we are doing, you know, and trying to every single Wednesday to to do something, you know, like in the Domino Racing Art Department, you know, we are doing our pieces of Domino Racing Art, which are pretty nice. You know, if for the Lowbreakers book, art book, we're trying to do every single character for, for the for, from the game to put it into to put it into the art book. You know, let me see if I can show you so so you can understand what I'm trying to say because that's that's the only that's the problem that I have. Is sometimes it's difficult to understand me because I'm still learning, you know, the language and stuff. Let me see if I can. Yeah show you what we're doing over here oh well, we had those those little breakers things over there yeah every single page that you see over here is not final we're still in development you know we're gonna like this one we we don't have the, the i had to remove this page from the from the album because the, the pages are not like that anymore i'm gonna be like like this you know in the middle so a little description about what you're seeing and maybe some comments from the maybe some comments from the community over here which is gonna be pretty nice you know is uh, the first uh, this is the first page then we have the second page now we got the third page and a fourth page for the for the banger class the maverick banger class had to change it um, uh, the, the the correct correct name for the for the class, you know. Yeah, the same thing we're gonna do with the with the enforcer, you know. This is gonna be our this is our first our first page for the enforcer, you know. It's gonna have the symbol of the of the faction that he belongs in the back, just like we did with the banger. With the banger class, you know, that we we bust. Let me see if I can show you again. You know, that's that's the symbol of the Valkyries, you know, in the back. I believe this is the symbol of the banger. Oh no, it's the symbol of the class. That's the symbol of the class. You know, but that's the symbol of the class banger. You know, the symbol is gonna be with the enforcer. You know, we're gonna have put the the symbol in the back, but we need to finish the the characters. That we were uh, we were uh, using. Let me see if I can find the the reference where I, I took to do this to do this class thingy. To do the enforcer. Should I be have I, I should have it <laughs> beforehand, but for some reason I lost it. Let me see if I can find it. It's a pretty common uh, screenshot from the break. It's one of the most common screenshots out there. It's not difficult to find it. But, uh, I have it in my computer, but now I cannot find it. I don't know why. Yeah, because I have lo lo so many pictures of the break and everything, so it's kind of difficult for me to find it. It's kind of a little difficult for me to find it, but it's a pretty, pretty common a screenshot of the breakers, you know? It's one of the most, most commons out there. Oh, it looks like I didn't save it to, to my computer the last time. Yeah. Oh, that, that, that was... It was really crazy because I always say those those things as reference, you know, in my 
in my catalog, in my group of pictures. It looks like uh, I didn't, I didn't this time, so I'm gonna look for it again. Let me see. Low breakers. Yeah, it's pretty, it's pretty common. Oh, what is oh? Yeah, people, I I fixed my my work on tablet. Yeah, I was having some problems. You know, I, I wasn't having the. I didn't have the the drivers from my work on tablet last time I was using, but now I was searching. It, it is no, it is no anymore in the in the website. You know, the the drivers that they provide me, they, they didn't work. You no, know, but because I I used to have those drivers a long time ago. You know, I, I I check it out a little bit. I found it. I found it between. Well, I selected this picture because it was big. Let me see if I, oh, let me see if this one is gonna work for me. Yeah, because it was, it was big. Every, oh yeah, yeah. This this is the one. You know. I had to fly, I had to no three no of course no it's only the 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 the, the guy in the middle you know the enforcer that, that's what we're doing in the enforcer you know? I select this picture because it's very big picture to show me you know the enforcer and everything as you can see you see yeah we're not going for a one to one representation of the of the model or anything like that you know to avoid possi possible 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 um, copyright thing is now, uh, because we don't we don't wanna we don't wanna mislead people into think that it's the original, it's the original creation, you know. It's it's, it's a it's a what we doing over here. It's a art book, a fun art book, you know. It's, it's, so we we have to keep it to keep it fun, you know. I'm trying to be the Chris. For one, one thing is, is the copyright. Another thing is like I don't have the expertise. You know, I don't have the expertise to do like a one-to-one -one representation of the of the original. <laughs> you know, you need to be like pretty good in order to do it. You know, you need to be like a pretty good in order to do something like that. Uh, I don't have the time. Um, it's not what we're looking for over here, you know. It's not what we're looking for. We need one of one of the one of the objectives of this art book is to, to to say thank you to the people to play the game, you know. To say thank you to the people to to, to come to my channel, you know. Because I don't know if you knew, Lobrikas Lobrikas was was basically the the reason why I'm why I'm streaming the game. Because I, I was on stream for a long, long time ago, but thanks to the breakers, I come back to streaming and everything, which is pretty nice. Yeah, I'm, I'm trying to look for the for the basically the you know basically the same kind of point that we that we, I was using because because I fixed the work on tablet because I fixed the work on with the with the with all the drivers the you no know, and everything a lot of features of the tablet became being available right now like uh, I can I can press like pressure and everything okay you can all, only go Make a line pretty light like that, you know. It's, it's, it's gonna be like clear and everything. It's gonna be, but you can do something like that at the same time, like a more. You see how black is it? This is by me putting a little bit more pressure into the tablet, you know, because the tab those tablets has like a pressure, something, you know. It really detects the pre the amount of pressure you put in the tablet. So I need to be careful right now how I do the draw, draw my lines and everything because I don't want 
to have a, a part like a pretty ba a pretty black and other pretty light, you know. It, it needs to be consistent. But today it's gonna be nice because we're gonna use this pencil thingy. Yeah. By the way, this is this is this software is our rage. By the way, it's our rage. Pretty nice software to make to make the made like a art and everything, you know. Uh, it is. It was in the. I believe it was in in a Steam. I believe it's, it's no more. I believe. I don't know. I was looking the other the other day. Uh, it didn't. Let me see. Let me see if I can check it out. Yeah, I was looking the other day. Like the store. Store page. You see, there is no store page anymore. If you look at art and rage. Can find nothing. I believe I read something about it in the in the in the official website of our race. There was there was talking about it like a, oh we are not we are not doing our race anymore in the Steam. She's kind of this kind of sad because I really like this software, but I don't want to I don't want to like to buy outside of Steam because Steam is like a my right now it's like a my main my main application for programs and games you know let me check it out my sounds my main my main yeah it's it's, it's, it's working pretty fine working pretty fine because sometimes you know they don't have no, you don't have no sounds when you have like almost an hour streaming you know because a lot of people came to the streams in no, doesn't even know if I got sound or not, you know. Doesn't doesn't even know. So they don't pay. A, they don't they don't tell you anything. Oh, it's supposed to be sound. Nah, they don't ask the questions and anything. Sometimes after an hour, you, you realize, oh, I know how I know how sound. It's not happening lately, you know. It, ha it used to happen before for oof, so many times. But it's not happening uh, right now, which is pretty good. Yeah, we're gonna use it this line this pen thing oh I, I saw a driver already click to start no I'm not gonna click it I'm gonna I'm gonna wait it for later you tell me later later I'll go over there and check it out after the streams yeah we're using the this pen thing which is yeah that's that's what we're gonna use you know now it's working fine because before it wasn't working in the ways I, I expect him to work. Let me put this uh, bigger, bigger point. Oh, this is too big. Let me see. Let me do three. Yeah, three is more or less the, the one I using. The uh, hundred percent. No, it's too big. It's too big. It needs to be like a one or two. Yeah, one is pretty good. Let me see two. Yeah, this is a problem with the Wacom tablets and stuff like that. They give you some freedom. Some freedom. You don't memorize the numbers. You're gonna have a lot of inconsistency in the in between the, 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 the pages. Between the stuff. I'm gonna say I'm gonna say say hi to the people the people that's coming to the stream I'm gonna say say hi to the people say hi to the people yeah say hi to the people so you can have some shout outs you know don't 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 hesitate don't hesitate to to ask questions about the game low breaks you know the it's set up it's set up to, it's free to play right now you know it's free to play right now you can go to the Steam um um I'm and download again, you know, you don't need to buy it anymore. Yeah, you don't need to buy anymore. It's just for a lot of people it was good, no? That now is the game is free to play. You know, you don't have to spend any money in the game. For the community, it's kind of sad, you know. There is no ways. There is no ways to. Let me see if I can do it like that. It's kind of sad for the community. That there is no way for us to. Oh. To, to, you 
you know, the, if I if I go pretty, there's a problem over here because see, look at this line, you know, and now look at this line. It's totally different, you know, <laughs> totally different. This one, the second one, it give me more control. Is by the way, it's using the same width, you know, the same width. That's what they call it, width, two sides, the same two side tree. Those are using the, the same tree, you know. But because w one is trying to be, this is giving me more control, the bolder one, this one. It's using like a control, to have, more, to have more control. It goes automatically, it goes like pretty big. That's what we was talking about. Look, this one and this one. No kind of difference just because if I push a little bit more push a little bit less they, they give me a totally different line which is I can I can fix it by giving like uh, to do by telling to the to the tablet that, that uh, I don't know how they call it, but, but you need to press more in order to 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 go to to, to make it some change or anything, you know. Oh, what is that? I don't know what is that. What what what? I don't know what happened with this. But it looks like I, it was I was painting by mistake over here too. That's crazy. We did like in two times at the same time. Yeah. <laughs> Let me see if I can do it without using that control thing. Yeah. The only problem like this and the way I'm doing it like that is that I take the risk. I'm taking the risk that, that have like a different lines everywhere. Like different different kind of lines everywhere, you know. I don't want that. You see, like as those are two different type of lines, very crazy situations. I don't want that kind of craziness, you know. Especially when I do all this last last line work the line work yeah that's how they call it, line work hasugita welcome to the stream mr hasugita welcome to the streams hasugita say hey buddy how, how you doing i am here hanging now but i should bring you to connect it today 20 anniversary of the stream oh that's pretty nice it's pretty nice one of the best fish special shooters out there look nook in 3d when when the nook came came in to the market when they released the nook they, they, they innovate a lot. It, it was a better, it, the Nokia was a pretty innovative first person shooter. It brings, it brings like a more realistic weapons, more realistic mechanics. The words, the stages, or the words, I, I don't know how you call it. Uh, the places, the environments, pretty realistic too. We got a, we used to have like a actual, actual buildings, a actual cities. You know, it wasn't, it wasn't nothing like before. The developer used to, to basically simulate a city, you know. But it, that was the most wacky cities out there because because you had like a cities that whole whole buildings whole buildings move. It, it's supposed to be a city, you know. It's supposed to be a city, but it was almost simulated. Like it was like a a games a a game maze. You know, with the face of the city, but who can look can for who can look in 3D? It brings like a actual cities, actual places. You know, with more still, still they feel like a maze, mazes. You know, because at that time the, the maze concept in in the maze concept in the in the games, the first person shooters, stuff like that, was pretty big. Like everybody was doing that. 
Oh, I, did it. I got some controllers over here that I don't have. I don't have a sound controls over here, which is pretty, it's gonna be pretty crazy. Yeah. I need to put some controls. Because otherwise, it's gonna be pretty crazy. Look, like that. Like that one, not supposed to. <laughs> what? Everything is bonkers. Let me put this over here. This thing's back. Cardi Joker, thank you for the host, Mr. Cardi Joker. Thank you for the host. I really appreciate it, Mr. Cardi Joker. Oh, I got it. I got it. I just for I just forgot for a for a while. Mr. Cardi Joker, thank you for the host. Yeah, uh, the the concert, the Mace concert in in First Person Shooter was pretty huge at that time. It was the only way the people was was like making making the the environments and everything and it, it was it was because the engines you know the engines was pretty pretty old engines you know at that time it was state of the art but still they they couldn't manage they couldn't manage realistic measures or uh, realistic uh, test pictures and everything you know it was pretty, pretty, we're talking we're talking in the beginning you know we're talking in the beginning so it was pretty crazy for them for those Game engines, you know, to simulate little things. So, practically, practically the city was boxes. The houses were boxes, you know, and everything. So the, the engine can handle handle those, those graphics. I believe Doom Doom was like a the first game with with, with, with textures and everything, you know, pretty pretty. We're not talking about high, high def fidelity text, but the was the first game to do at that time to, to came with texture and accelerated accelerated graphics. You know, then that we had Duke Duke. Then we had Heretic, I believe Heretic, Yeah, I don't know the 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 the, the, the actual order. It was if it was Duke Duke first or was the Heretic first, but they all they all was. At that time, I remember they were winning that time, you know, making making news, making headlines everywhere, which is very ni nice, you know. Doom was a, a game, I believe, Doom Nukem too. Those those were a game that was like a bang for many countries, censor, you know, in many countries, like a I believe German was one of those countries, you know, that you can. Nobody, you couldn't buy the game over there, you know. Uh, over here in, in USA, it was co pretty controversial, too. which is, was pretty crazy at the time. How should you say? So how you doing, man? How was your night? Oh, my night was pretty nice, you know. I didn't went to the, I didn't went to the work today to my day job because I I was feeling pretty bad. Uh, so I stayed home. I was practically sleeping the whole day, <laughs> practically sleeping the whole day, you know, get my energies back, uh, because yesterday, yesterday was a pretty, pretty crazy situation, that job I had to, I had to stop going, I had to look for another job, one of my, one of the, my main goals is to, is to have a car right now, so I can get, I can look for other jobs, you know. So if I have a car, I can go other places and look for for jobs far away from here. Because that's that's a that's one of the problems I have right now. That every single job or anything that I have to look at, it has to be close to my house. You know, it really it's really limiting factor. It's a really limiting factor, you know. I need to. I need to go out far away and look for jobs far away in order to find better stuff, you know. Maybe move, maybe to move to another town, Massachusetts, or to another state, you know. Maybe nobody, nobody knows, you know, because because the job I have is 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 is, is, is taking a toll, you know. Is 
It's really hurting me pretty pretty crazy. Hasagito said, oh nice, I am skipping streaming tonight because I need to get some sleep. I'm so exhausted from the last few weeks on the non sleep. Yeah man, you, you gotta stop doing that. You gotta stop doing that. You should you you, you you gotta do something. Some schedule that you okay. At this time from this time I do streaming, at this time this time I do something else, you know? Because uh, so you want to take streaming like a full time you need to you need to have a schedule otherwise you're gonna kill yourself you're gonna kill yourself by doing real life activity and doing streaming stuff you know you're gonna it's gonna hurt you uh, uh, I try not to do that with games or anything no? you know so have I schedule because People maybe doesn't know, but streaming takes a lot, a lot of from you, man. It takes a lot of energies. You know, a lot of people didn't realize how. Yeah, many, many streamers have been talking about it. You know, how, how streaming is like a full-time job. You know. So you need to, you need to be careful. Oh, so I did a five hour string early today. I beat Jerica. Oh, that was very nice. I had to check it out the video. I wanna check it out the video. Because that is pretty nice. That game when it came out, it was huge because Clyde Baker it was involved in the game and everything. The creator of the of the movies, uh, Hellraiser movies and everything. I, the writer, I believe. I'm not pretty sure. So you can, you can add how to get to that information. I'm gonna appreciate it. Yeah, I believe it's the writer. Man, when they got when that game came in, it was he was huge. I remember. I was like a what? Uh, now that now we got now we got like a. Actual people that work in Hollywood and everything doing doing video games, you know. It was I be, I believe it was the first time I heard about something like that, you know. It was a it was at a time that the game the game industry, you know. We're talking about Flappy uh, before Flappy Birds, you know, before Pokemon Go's and everything, you know, before the gaming industry was like a uh, super huge because now it's super huge it's bigger than some people say like it's bigger than Hollywood right now you know something that is it's pretty crazy to know you know how so can I say I wish more devs would use the Clyde Berger's ideas then it was also again a few years early Kelly Clyde Berger's the undying wish undying which was very was pretty good. Oh, I believe I heard about that one. Yeah, I think I heard I heard about that one too. But that one, that one, nobody, almost nobody knew about that one, right? Because the the one that make it like a headlines and everything was Jericho. Jericho was the one that I really spot. Yes, that that. In games, it's pretty easy. In games, it's pretty easy to 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 know know about some games like uh, the marketing department. I don't know. Marketing for games is pretty expensive, and it's not effective in the way that people do it because there is so many games that just go under the radar. You know, can be go under the radar. Like today, can be today. Maybe some games are releasing, but. So you're not gonna see, you know, you will not see trailers anywhere from that game. Maybe that that game has trailers. Maybe two, three years later on, you're gonna know about the game. That is, that's pretty crazy. This is not, this is not good for for the games, you know. This is not good for the games. Hasukidas, yeah, on that was I think PC. And no advertise 
Jericho had much better marketing, but a lot of people didn't like the difficulty or switching between six characters to get through a stage, which I found fun. Oh yeah, yeah, that, that was, that's all another feature. That's all another, another crazy feature of the, of the game that you, you can use any character of your party. That was really nice too. I play a Battlefield, a Battlefield from, play, from PS4 like that too. I really, there is, there is a couple games that do that too. That you can switch between classes on the fly, you know. In Battlefield, in the, in the Battlefield on Tech, I believe it was the first Modern Warfare for, the first Modern Warfare for Modern or something. It's for, it's for, for, for Spear, PS, PS3 I believe. PS3 or PS2, PS2, I believe. Yeah, PS2. You used to switch between characters on the fly, like you got the characters in the in the in the battlefield fighting. And you can switch between the sniper and everything. Uh, they did they did that they did that that gameplay is specifically for consoles, not in order to play with different classes in the same major in a console. They did it like that because. Uh, it, it was it's kind of difficult you know for consoles sometimes to, to do the switching on the fly so they did they always have like a in the battlefield you have to look at it to look at the car at the classes you have to you want to switch and press the like a, a switching button for that which is sometimes it creates crazy uh, situation for you because not only you switch the card, you you tele you teleport to the location of that of that class. Sometimes you don't realize it, it, it puts you in difficult situations. Uh, what what makes make, it makes a the battlefield game pretty pretty difficult. I really that's what happened with the with the Clive Baker too. Clive Baker too. The, the people people they found it difficult because because sometimes uh, the switching it puts you in diff in difficult situations. But I had to check it out to make sure make sure it's like that. Because it was a long time ago. A long time ago I see that that game. I used to have another another. I, I used to know another person that that like that like that game all the time. They used to play that game all the time. Which is pretty, is very, which is pretty nice. I always wanted to play Jericho, but the 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 terror the part the scary part of the game doesn't let me. Because I try not to not to play scary games. I don't, I don't like a lot to play scary games. Hasukito say it was it was D-pad and pushed the direction of the name of the character, or there was a quick transfer by just looking at the character you wanted and pressing the button. Oh yeah, I love it. But each of the six characters had two weapons attack and two magic attack, which was too hard for a lot of people to remember. Oh. Yeah, I got. A, I used to have a friend playing this that game all the time. He did tell me something similar. Like the game was pretty difficult. It was pretty hard. He was he was fan of the head racer series too. That's why that's why he knew about that game. Especially that the marketing was pretty good too. It was pretty good because I'm not a head racer fan. I'm not I'm not a Clyde Baker fan either. You know. Yeah, yeah, I know, I know about the game too. You know, I know about the game. Yeah, I saw the movies and race when I was young. So it's not like I, I'm a stranger. I know a strange or or his work, you know. But I, I don't try. I try. I, I try to avoid pretty hard. I avoid pretty hard scary things. That's that's the bottom line. That's what I'm trying to say. You know, I I I avoid. Very hardcore, scary things because I practically stay myself alone almost all the time. So having having to remember scary things is no it's not healthy for me.
But yeah, right now it's pretty common to have people like that, uh, writers like that, trying to make games. You know, like, like Hasukidon told me the other day, Riddle Scott, right? He's trying to do a game now, or a game company, something like that. So it's pretty common. Feel free, Hasukidon, to talk about it if you want. Uh, it's pretty common now to see that kind of people doing doing the doing some games or something like that, which is pretty nice. Yeah, there is a there is a little problem with this. How they call it? Pen? Uh -huh, ink pen in this in this program they try to correct so the line it, it goes like a the more correct or, or straight ways but sometimes it doesn't like a, if I do the the angle like that when they correct you, you see like it's totally different it's totally different so you need to do like a by parts where you you risk it you risk it to, to, to look ugly on the end. Oh, J.J. Abrams, yeah. Hasukino says J.J. Abrams is making the game development co Oh, J.J. Abrams, yeah. Oh, it's a game development company. Oh, I thought it was a game. Oh, if, if he's doing a, a, a game development company, it's going to be nice. We're going to be seeing a lot of a lot of J.J. Abrams, maybe, maybe games just like just like Tom Clancy and Ubisoft you know the Ubisoft used to work with Tom Clancy indirectly I believe he did make a lot of cr uh, beautiful games from Tom Clancy you know but it's pretty nice now it's pretty common that people like that writers or, or authors are taking the time to to, to to work with the games, you know. We work with this new kind of of multimedia, interactive multimedia, you know, interactive media, which is which is something that they a lot of those people do, didn't didn't get to do. Because it was another age when when the movies and books was the movies and books was the leader, you know, and everything. But now we are in the age of the games, you know. So you can do basically the same thing you do in the books and more, because the game has this layer of interactivity that that the book doesn't have, you know. The, the movies doesn't have it either, you know. I was. In the future, in the future, maybe, yeah, you know, because you know, everything, some technology, new technology came, came to the market, you know, people began to, to, to speculate, you know, if for a long, long time, well, I was, I was, a, I was a kid when people was talking about uh, interactive movies, just like at the game Detroit, become human, you know, games, like, uh, movies like that, they, that the people that was watching the movie used uh, get to decide, get to decide maybe for a boat, for a boat system or something. You know, get to decide the fate of the of the protagonist. You know, which is it sounds very nice. You know, a movie that is not just a movie is 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 a interactive experience for everybody watching the movie in the time, like for the whole room the whole movie theater you know like all these guys this guy has been talking lies to me while trying to do you know just to help him or to let let him die you know so stuff like that so that the room the whole room get to decide what's gonna happen with this guy so at the end we got different out, out. The, 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 the game Detroit become human is more or less like that you know you know but it is not a hundred percent a move a interactive movie because it has a lot of gaming elements 
it was pretty clear that game was pretty clear not developed by not developed to to be a, a movie it was developed to be more a game than anything else yeah in the case of other movie uh, it should have less less gaming less gaming uh, elements you know like uh, in Detroit become human you have sometimes to interact interact with many little things that sometimes it's not even worthy you know sometimes it's not even worthy to interact but I don't I didn't play the game so I don't know how important sometimes is to to grab some little things over here or or say some things over there you know but more or less, um, those kind of games is trying to explain how maybe, how maybe in the future movies are gonna be, you know, or not all the movies, maybe could be some kind of movies, you know. At this point, we should have something like that already, you know, like in the mainstream and everything. Uh, it's pretty. It's pretty weird that we don't have stuff like that because I remember in the in the age of the Sega CD and Sega Saturn, not so much Sega Saturn, but Sega CD and and 3DO, 3DO, uh, Panasonic 3DO. You remember that console? You used to have a lot of games like that with movies and stuff. That sometimes they tell you, "Oh man, what what we are supposed to do it now?" You have to tell them. It's like an interact, interactive movie. Pretty crappy at the time, you know, because the technology, the technology wasn't there. But you can see, you can see, you know, it's a pretty good example that so you can see the people that was trying to do those kind of stuff for a long, long time, for a long, long time, you know. People was trying to do stuff like that for a long, long time. Had to check it out there, the real picture because. That part over there is kind of different from the original. Yeah. Yeah, for a long, long time, people were trying to do interactive movies. So there is a, maybe a sub subset of, of many communities that are waiting for this kind of experience, you know. Waiting for those kind of, of experience. The Sega CD games that used to be like that, like at the NTV one, they make your own videos, you know, Dragon Slayer, uh, Night Trap. Also, those games at that time was pretty successful, you know. Then it was another, it was another one too, pretty nice, like a kind of cyberpunk. Subway Shop was another one. You know? It was, that, that one was most, most more a game than, than a movie. You know, but they ha used to have like a real actors and everything. We, I don't know how, how the, the American uh, customers, you know, the American gamers saw those those games like uh, now they're making a phone they're making fun the how cheesy they look like and everything but at that time at that time it kind of put a gaming those kind of game put gaming like a like a in, in a pretty good place like a, oh you like movies we got these games that are like movies but you control it you know like uh we're talking at the time that that people used to 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 like a lot of movies, you know. Right now, people still like movies. I'm not gonna say no, but you can find people that only dedicate themselves to, to only dedicate themselves to to games, you know. So we're talking at a time that it was more people into movies and everything. Then you have those games that look like movies. Uh, it, it sounds it sounds to me like a, it was a pretty good time for gaming. No, like people was looking at the games more importance more importance than ever like oh no those, those games are pretty cool you know from people that doesn't game no 
like, oh no, those games are like a movies. I remember, I remember games in when when 2600 people used to use used to use this phrase like, oh, this this game is like a is like a computer, you know? This is not like a toy anymore. No, so so games games really enjoy many times you know from from being being like a, a pretty high tech kind of thing you know a pretty important part of like a very important very very important yeah uh, piece of technologies you know like it's, it's, it's not just for entertainment it's, it's like a kind of computer you can resolve problems you can you can learn something about those those things not like now and like now people see games like toys you know people see games like toys they don't they don't see games before the games used to have like a this this is almost a scientist a scientist uh, recognition you know like or you can learn stuff from this game this game is, is like a computer you can resolve problems yeah you you got you, you used to have those games too you used to have games map games educational games that I don't see no anymore you know before you used to have like educational games that really teach you something that like almost nobody I don't know if it's that that genre from the game are still there most of, most of the education games used to be like a click, point and click adventures stuff, you know? Very nice stuff. It wasn't made by recognized, this is another thing, you know? It wasn't made by recognized companies or anything. But it was very nice. Oh, I believe, I believe we got couples of those games in, in ST, like a build your own PC. No, flip, flip house simulator or something like that. But you can more or less learn something. I, I don't know if they're using real life elements in those games. Because that's the point. That's the point, you know. All, all educational games, they teach you math, sometimes biology, stuff like that. You know, they mix it up with some plot, some history. So you you kind of learn and get entertained at the same time, but I don't know if they they, they do it like that anymore, you know. No. Now everything is so straightforward. No, now everything is so straightforward that he lost the mystic. You know, he lost the mystic from from the old times. You know, in the old times, even a teacher used to be like a pretty. You know, has the mystic stuff that. Oh, you, you need to do this because you, you for the future. And it, like a, it was like a not only the thing that you, you learn, you know, it was like a some kind of background history on everything, you know, that, that you can you don't see anymore. No, you don't see anymore in, in games or anything. You no, know? like a, everything is so straightforward, which is which is is it's not entertaining. Sometimes it's kind of boring. That's that's why people people get like a jaded jaded with the games right now. Pretty tired, you know. Like a, a game just came in, they don't even play, it, but they already kind of know where where this game goes, you know. People people kind of know like eh, I believe this game is gonna be like this, like that. It's just not it's not gonna be good, you know. Yeah, people cannot know the direction of many things, you know, which is, which is pretty crazy. It is, no, it is basically no a surprise, you know, the surprise element is lost, which is, which is, is uh, it's pretty sad, it's kind of sad, you know, that sometimes people already know what they're going to get it before something is released there is so many so many information to companies right now they're, they're hyping machines you know they're hyping machines they just wanna just wanna hype everything man 
in the high process they, they, they spoil many things in the games, you know, many information that are not supposed to be released is there. You got people that go to those companies, talk to those developers, you know, uh, I put information out there too. You know, like today is, is kind of crazy. A lot of a lot of stuff are not controlled a hundred percent. A lot of stuff are not controlled a hundred percent. It is, and it's kind of sad. You know, it's kind of sad. I, I know people that I know people that avoid all kind of trailers for that for that reason. For that reason, they try to avoid all kind of trailers. They try to avoid all kind of stuff for that reason. Uh, it's not supposed to be like that. The trailers supposed to be more, more uh, smart. How they deliver the content so they don't spoil anything. You know, they're supposed to be more. If they want to hype everything, that's okay because that that's just like a natural, uh, natural. Uh, it's, it's, it's something that, that is expected, you know. It's expected. The hype, something that is expected. Nobody take can take it for from a piece of trailer or anything, you know. One of the the main purpose of the trailer is to is to hide the things, you know, to, to tell to the people how awesome is this game or how awesome is this movie or how awesome is this book or whatever they are advertising. That's that's why the main purpose, you know, to hype things, to make people understand the the idea behind it, it to it, it to make the purchase, you know, to make the purchase because it's a business. Uh, bottom line, it's a business, you know. People, those companies, spend spend so much time doing those things, you know, those experience. Uh, they put uh, so much money those experience, you know, hiding people that know how to work on those things. Uh, I believe this is, yeah, this is very really good. Let me see if I can show a little bit. Yeah, the language is, 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 is going pretty good. No pro, you know, no pro, no 100% pro, but it's, it's going to be pretty acceptable for the, for the things we're doing over here. Which is pretty good. I really like it. I have to do the face. Something I'm leaving. I'm leaving for later. Because the face is always the most complicated part of the character. Yeah, really. I don't wanna. I don't wanna do it like a hundred percent, like at the original. But, but at least that uh, people had an, an idea. You know that the how is the guy. You know. Because. I don't know if you something like I did it. Let me show you something like I did it with the with the Bangar class, you know. Okay, over here you cannot see the face, you know. Over here you can see a little bit of the face, but you see the face, you say, "Oh, this is Maverick. This is not the the Toscan Knight, you know." No. You more or less can see, "Oh, this is Maverick, not the Toscan Knight." The Toscan Knight has a, another hair. Like a, a mohawk or stuff like that, you know? but I don't ra I don't really like to go realistic. So that's why I just paint a little bit the face like that, you know, like look like an anime or something like that. Because I don't really like the realistic approach and nothing, you know. Realistic has his own merit, you know. I'm not gonna say it's bad or anything. It, it's like for me. Re at this age, because that's the point. In the past, in the past, realistic was a very impression, impressive, at least for me, because you didn't have the technology, you know, to do realistic stuff. So you, you, you got those guys that used to do everything realistic, every paint, everything super realistic, man, because the technology wasn't there. Every time they make a sculpture, they make it pretty realistic. Every time they can make a drone, they make it pretty realistic. This guy was working in, on, on newspaper, on magazines, 
No, because they they were the printers and the 3D printers of the of the time. You know those people. But now that we got 3D printers, and now that we got printers that print photorealistic stuff, and computers that do pro photorealistic. Man, there is a there is even programs, programs. Right now they are making programs with some kind of AI that you can that they can paint photorealistic photo stuff from for you. Like oh, I want I want a beach with a lot of water, coconuts, and you you tell them what you want. They, they just they just put those elements in the picture. They paint a you know they paint a paint for you. So in the future nobody's gonna paint. Computers are gonna pay for you. No, they are making those things over there. So the things I'm doing right now is gonna uh, in the future is gonna be a total waste of time because you're gonna have the 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 tools to do it. But not everything is 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 supposed to be like that, you know. Just oh, let me do, you know. It's, there is there is some reason why people do it, you know. There is some reason why people do it. It has a therapeutic, a therapeutic uh, objective. How, how how you can say it? results? That's what I'm trying to say. Results. There is a therapeutic result. You know, uh, it's fun to to make, to do your own drawings. You know, in the, in the game Detroit Become Human, there is a there is a guy that can explain that. You know. Oh, we live in a future where everything is machines, computers, pretty advanced stuff. But he's still he's still doing his own thing, you know, his own paintings, his own, you know, his own things. Because for him, it's, it's almost like a religion, you know. It's almost like a religion that it's, you can, humanity not supposed to be that advanced that forget about those. Values, those things that we got, we got inside. You know, I don't know if it's that psychology or, or if it, you know, that really helps to be to continue forward. You know, the belief in a superior being, the the belief uh, many, you know, those are elements that it help people to continue forward in life. You know, to give it some kind of some kind of goal you know and painting and drawing has to do a lot with with that because people, people when people painting with people drawing they get inspired you know and they, they got in this in this pretty high level unconscious you know pretty high level of conscious you they're like in heaven you know when you paint you do you feel like you are in heaven like a, there is no problem in your life you are pretty entertained you are pretty inspired, you know. Yeah, almost everything you imagine, you can make it real, you know. Uh, so, in 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 that game, the guy explained that. They explained that to a robot, you know, to a uh, to somebody that is, is a robot that is not supposed to have, be feeling those those stuff, you know. Somebody that doesn't have the capacity, you know, to to feel or to or to get inspired. Yeah, pretty crazy situation, people. What? Yeah, I always it's a problem always with the with the round rounded rounded elements of the of the thing. It's always gonna be a problem doing it doing it with this tool because this tool it tried to straight everything. So rounded rounded stuff are pretty difficult to do it when using this stuff because what the tool does is try to strain to, to make everything straight you know everything is smooth I believe there is some settings that you can change let me see oh man this thing is always being in a problem I believe there is some rotation it's like a song Something that you can. This is square head. There is some. Yes, there is some. 
options you can change so so make it make it better but I have to I need to put some time on it because this I believe yeah there is some option that can you can make it like a they make it straight but respect the the corpse you know but at the same time respect the corpse which is that something that I want to look at that, that he just avoid the, the whole curve whatsoever you know I'm trying to do it like that you see look oh. <laughs> he just uses something else try to make it straight no matter what but it's a big help it's a big help yeah I'm gonna say thank you to the people that subscribe to my channel you know subscribing to the streams which is very nice pretty awesome the people that supporting my stream when I began this, this channel, I couldn't, I couldn't believe. I, I didn't have the. When I when I began this channel, I couldn't. I couldn't understand, you know, the people subscribe to channels and everything. So I couldn't believe when when I began to to get actual subscribers to my channels, you know, I couldn't believe it. I say, oh man, people like my content, you know. It is it is pretty nice, you know, to feel that people really really. Not only, not only enjoy your content, but really want to help you to continue forward, you know. Uh, it, it is very nice, you know. It's very nice. It really motivates me to continue forward. It really helps a little bit, you know. With many of the things that I'm trying to do, like this, uh, like this art book and the, and the, and the giveaways, you know. That I'm, I'm planning to, to do giveaways all the time, you know. I begin long time a few months in, uh, last year, November, yeah, November was, November 2017 was the first give it away. Uh, I'm, it's been like kind of hard, it's been kind of hard to keep it up, but I want to keep it up, you know, I want to keep it up, I want, I want that to be something, uh, something from, you know, forever in this channel. I'm gonna say thank you to Mr. Cole Ninja Gaming. Thank you for the sub. Thank you for everything you do. I really appreciate it, Mr. Cole Ninja Gaming. Looking forward, Mr. Cole Ninja Gaming, to see you more often in the in the in the stream because, as you can see, you are not here anymore. <laughs> yeah, Mr. Cole Ninja Gaming is not here anymore. Uh, yeah, he was going down, going down. You know, being substituted by other people is is outside the the little but not for not for much not for too much you know it's just one guy you know that was watching stuff almost all the time not for too much oh another thing i was i was talking i'm gonna say i wanna think i don't think i'm gonna say people if you don't follow the channel i'm not gonna be able to to you're gonna stop receiving the points so you don't follow the channel because i see a lot of people they are not following my channel when I check it out. They are bots, they are some bots, you know. Bots, they are no people, they are bots. Yeah, that's that's one way I know they are, they are bots, you know. Because the bots, most of the time, they don't follow you, they just go to the channel, get the points, but they don't follow you. So, that's that's one way I know the those people are bots. So, if, if you don't follow me, if you are not a bot. What a person like watching my stream. Do you like to watch my stream? You don't say hi in the in the chat because this are other things. You can over here. You can you can say hi to the people. So we know you are a person we know about. You know that's the one of the reasons I really like um, the people to say hi. You know another thing is as you know follow me. Man. You know I'm gonna be every single week. I do reviews of the people over here. You know, make sure that they are people and no <laughs> and no bots, you know. I ask questions and everything. If you don't respond or anything, you you're gonna be those points you're gonna be taken away from you. You know? If you don't respond those way good thing that ninety percent of the people over here I know those guys, you know. So those guys those are no problem. But Ian Fusion, if you are there in the chat, say hi. And B and K say hi if you are there in the, the chat, you know. Otherwise, 
I'm gonna be checking out you guys because you are new in the channel uh, and I wanna know if you are if you are a bot or you are a real person because it happens to me that like a lot of bots are watching my stream yeah people so you can follow Mr. Code Ninja Game it's pretty nice streamers you know streaming all kind of games all kind of games which is pretty nice pretty awesome right now lately he's kinda not streaming a lot yeah, but you, the only way you know if he is streaming or not is by following him. So it's a pretty good, it's a pretty good idea that you follow the Code Ninja game. You know, it's a pretty, it's free, so you know, not nothing's gonna be missing. I'm gonna say thank you to Mr. Hasagidon, pretty awesome dude, Hasagidon peoples. Hasagidon, as you can see, is in the chat talking and everything. Give me, bring me, bring it the knowledge to streams all the time, all the time. You know, it's a guy that you know, doesn't take uh, a light response, you know. It's a guy that really is going to request for you qualities, you know. It's really is going to request from you on honesty, you know. Because you're going you're gonna to get called him out for House, house of Eden, see if see you say something to him that it sounds a little bit off, you know. Which is, I really appreciate it. Those are values, people. Maybe you don't understand. Maybe maybe you don't understand from people like that. Those are values. And when you see a person like that that really cares that everything you do is 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 high quality. Those are the people that you need to stay stick to it. You know, those are the people you need you need to stick to it because there is values over there. You know, those are the people that are always gonna strive for you to be successful. You know, kind of hard sometimes because. We as a human, we don't want to, to to do difficult stuff. We don't want difficult stuff. We want everything, you know, easy and fun and everything, you know. Uh, but unfortunately, real things, real things that are really gonna give you give you the edge, you know. They're gonna they're gonna put you out there. I know all the time fun, you know. It's not all the time about fun about things. So. You, I wanna say thank you to Hasha Gidon to be one of the guys, one of the first guys supporting this channel since September. I decided to begin to stream it. He was here. He was one of the, those guys that came over here and stick to my to my stream, helping me to go to go forward every day. You know, in some different ways. That with the subscriptions, you know, we're bringing the knowledge to the stream. Call me to the chat and talk to him. You know. I kind of feel bad that I, I couldn't I couldn't do the same thing to, for him, you know. But I'm trying, you know. He knows, he knows I'm trying to to you know to do my part too because that's that's how relationships are. That's how relationships are, you know. Uh, it's it's something that they give it to you, but you have to give back to you know. So the relationship is is keep it healthy. It's a two way. It's a two-way direction. Hasagino says, you are much kind, good sir. You do more than enough, man. Oh, thank you. Thank you, Mr. Hasagino. You recognize. Thank you, Hasagino. You recognize, but... Uh, I, I'm going to say, man, uh, uh, this this trip and this, this is streaming thing, it has been more fun, has been... Uh, better because you you guys are here, you know, because you are here, Mr. Hasugino and everything has been better, you know, because because you are here every day. Um, it's difficult, you know, it's difficult for me to when you do something alone and everything, but thanks to when you got people like Hasugino, you know, they give you the support, you kind of you kind of take it, the stuff more seriously you know you take this so more serious that you're gonna you're gonna develop that 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 sentiment that you don't wanna you don't wanna skip any days you know you don't wanna skip any days and anything because you know the people that really care about you are waiting for you streams and everything you know it which is a pretty good fit it's a pretty good fit it makes it makes me it makes everything over here very important feel very important you know so people you can follow mr mr house again I really appreciate it, you know, you not going to regret, regret it because Hasugino is the, is the kind of people that you support him, he's going to support you back, 
no matter what, man. Has you know, it's, 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 like him, is 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 there is no people like him. A guy that that he always striving for for be better every day, for be better every day. You know, I wanna say thank you to Mr. Debbie Sachs. Thank you for everything you do. You know, Mr. Debbie Sachs. Thank you for the for the sub. People, the the Pisat, it's, it's a pretty, it's a pretty curious uh, situation with the Pisat. The Pisat came in to the streams one day. Since then, he has been uh, subscribing to my channel all the time. Uh, he not coming to the to the stream directly, as you can see. It's no, it's not in the leaderboards. He, he no, he not coming in the chat or and, and, uh, anything. But he keeps subscribing to my channel. You know. I don't know if it's a piece the real the real the real uh identity of the pizza is maybe a family of me, I don't know. Somebody say like uh, it's a Chris Blesinski uh Chris Blesinski a hidden hidden uh account, secret secret Twitch account. So he's trying to help me to, to, to continue playing little breaks and everything that way to say thank you. I doubt it. I doubt it, highly doubt it, because Cliff is a great guy, you know, but he, he has too many things to do, he's not going to be, he know more, more important people, more, you know, he know, he know Dr. Disrespect, people like that, you know, that, I believe it, it's, it's, it makes more sense for him to, to support those guys that support me, you know, uh, uh, despite I'm, I'm playing low breakers all the time, have radical highs, and those games like that. Uh, as you can see, my YouTube channel, I put, I put a video of the radical heights today, I believe. Yeah. So, despite all of that, I, it makes more sense for him, you know, to support a big, big, big time streamers than a guy that I made that you just beginning. But, yeah, the Mr. The Pisat. Uh, subscription over here is it's been good it feels good but at the same time it's kind of who is this guy you know it doesn't come to the stream but it's still subscribing you know who who, who is like a, there is so many questions but it, there is a the pizza has been managed to have like a this 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 myst, mystic and um, mysterious mysterious uh, energy you know around him which is pretty nice he's in my in my steam account he's in, he's in the, the low breakers too he's the, sometimes doesn't get online sometimes get, gets online you know but he's in the discourse in the discourse uh, low breakers discord like i had everywhere i go he's over there you know the which i really appreciate it you know i really i really want i really I really like when people you know take the initiative you know take the initiative or be involucrated you know to participate to support uh, without asking practically you know because that's 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 the case of the pizzazz you know he didn't he didn't make questions and he just subscribe everywhere he's kind of very knowledgeable he's very kind of not very knowledgeable in what he, what he does and, and what he all the technology works because he just went by himself without questions or anything. He was everywhere. He's in everywhere, you know. Uh, where where some people get stuck, he doesn't understand the pizza like I just, uh, understood. And and he went by himself. Subscribe. He did all the support, of everything he did by by himself. He took his time to do the things that which is pretty nice. I really appreciate. It. Yeah, people. I'm not gonna say you to follow. Me. I don't know if you want to follow Mr. De Pisa. I never see him streaming. I, I believe he's no a streamer. But if you can follow him, you know, you want to follow him. So maybe he got he got motivated to do a stream maybe in the future. You know, one one of the idea behind the Pisa, the Pisa is like a, he he's kind of a pretty busy guy. You know, that, that's why I believe he's no streamer because he's a pretty busy guy. That's the idea I get from him. You know, but thank you for everything you do, Mr. Pisa. Thank you for your support. I really appreciate it. It makes me really happy. Yeah, people, since I began to stream, I really feel very, 
very privileged. The, the people that came over here and watched my streams, they just came in to help me, you know, to help me to continue forward, man. They, they, they didn't... They didn't throw any time, you know, they didn't try to throw it there, you know. Yeah, there is some some videos, some streams that they that they came over here and make jokes, troll a little bit. It's 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 really fine with me, you know, because that's that's one of the objectives of the stream that you have found, you know, you can you can come over here, ask questions, be troll a little bit, you know. Have fun, man, because that, that's what games is all about. That's what this game is all about. Express yourself, you know. As long as it's not offensive or, or, you know, or gonna make me feel bad. It is pretty nice, you know. It is pretty nice. It's acceptable. I really like when people talk a lot in the chat. I really like it. Those are my best streams. My best streams are when people come over here, ask questions, and, and, and talk a lot in the chat. Because... It give me content for me to talk about it, you know. Uh, maybe they learn something from me, you know. Uh, it is pretty nice, you know. It is pretty nice. I really always try to to get to get some 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 something to talk, you know, some team to talk about it, you know, the gaming community and stuff. Because that that's the the not that's the goal in my streams is to be non-stop commentary streams, you know. So people can lay down in the bed, you know, use your headphone, you know, um, and listen to the streams. It's kind of podcast, you know. It's kind of pod. So we're talking stuff, you know, with a thing or something. And it looks like uh, a lot of developers, a lot of games, and and getting some flags, some backlash because they're using the red, the red shell, red shell uh, application in their games. You know, I don't know if you know, uh, the red shell is a, a little program that a lot of developers are using in the games in order to track in order to collect some kind of information you know like how many how many times you play the game in which country you are playing this game and w maybe w in which ser in which server you are connected and stuff like that you know some games ha has been has been put in the in the public opinion because not because they're using it it's because People bought the games without knowing that the red, the red shell was working in the background, collecting information that maybe is not by at all again, you know, it's, it's, it's not, it's most of the time anonymous information that doesn't reveal your own identity. But just because the fact that nobody knew those little programs was running in the background, you know? <laughs> Maybe maybe taking a lot of friends from you from you from you games, you know, because all DRM because this is a, a way this is a way of of DRM, you know, digital right management program. This is a kind of way for that. People was talking like it's a, a spyware. No, I don't believe it's a spyware. You know, I believe it's, it's more like a, a DRM. You know, a digital managed program. Yeah, it's more like that. Uh, it is it is pretty crazy, you know. That not that that that, that we're using it because I, I, at this time, at this time, let me tell you something. See, the technology is there. If the developers need that information in order to make a better service. I don't, I don't, I don't mind it. I don't mind it. But the problem was that they need to, you know, disclosure. They need to disclose, tell it to the people. Oh, this thing is running in the background. Like many programs does it. Many, many, many other services does that, you know? They tell you, oh, what, what they're going to do with, the, with your information, what kind of information they collect. Like almost every single website does it, you know? So wh why why you don't, you don't disclose 
that you are collecting information, you know? It's like my website, let me show you. My website, ah, I know, I know a big nothing. I know a big nothing, no big company, nothing, you know? But, let me show you, backcourt.net. But, I try to comply with the rules, you know? My website, you gain my website. The first thing you see in the bottom is like a at in this website use your data to tailor us to you our partners will collect data and use cookies for our personalization measurement you know right away when you you enter into my website they tell you that those these ads over here in the top you know are collecting information about you you know this is a new rule for European countries you need to you need to do my my, my blog too look on my blog my God, you get you get into the my blog, and the first thing you see in the bottom, it takes a while sometimes to 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 load. I don't know why they they, they should do these things more effective. You know, so, so it, 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 oh, oh because I accepted before I believe it, it doesn't happen anymore. Let me let me refresh it. Yeah, if you go to my to my blog to you're gonna see it. It looks like a, because I I, accept, I had to accept it, you know, in order to 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 click over here in the bottom. Yeah, it doesn't show. It doesn't show because I accept it. If I if I delete all the history, there's yeah, something that I'm not gonna do. It's gonna show in the bottom, which is it's gonna show like that. You see, like that. I'm not gonna click it because I wanna give the sample to the people so that is the way that you need to disclose you know you need to at least talk about it tell it to the people that you are collecting information you know it don't don't let don't let the people to to know by themselves because that's what happened that's what happened people know about it because this is for the developer I'm gonna tell you something the gaming community is not just gamers, students, people like doesn't, that doesn't know nothing. It's not kids. In the de de in the gaming developer, the gamers, the gamers, all the people, the games. A lot of them are developers too. A lot of them are programmers too. A lot of them are students of technologies. You know, so. You know, some some of them work for companies in the government, the FBI, CIA, stuff like that. If they game, you know, they check you, if they share your game and everything. If you put something like the red shell in your game, in order to track some information that maybe is 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 no, you know, it's not vital. You know, I'm not telling you it's bad. It's not vital. You can use it, you know, but you need to disclose it. You need to disclose it. Let me see if I can show. I can show you something about the red shell, red shell. So, I've been talking about it without, without, without telling you, with telling you now nothing, you know, without showing. You know, you go to, you can go to the. The official website of the Rex Shell. Find out which part of your marketing budget is actually working. You know, Steam. You got the Rex Shell. It's a, it's a, it's a. Are you a gamer? Click here to more to learn. To click here to learn more about us. This is something that is being put in many, many, many programs in order to track. Okay, so some information, you know. But I wanted to. To show, let, uh, let me see if I can. Okay, so. Yeah, I wanted to show some animations, not the not the whole video. No, uh, it is something that is totally, it's totally fine to me in my eyes. It's totally fine for any developer, any company, to get the information that they need so they can make better the products. You know, it's totally fine. But the, the problem is you need to disclose. People need to disclose. There is a lot of people open arms right now. Right now, there is a lot of people open arms. I can show you. I 
couple games that are really talking about it because people find out that the games was used in the red shell in order to track uh, some an uh, anonymous information that doesn't doesn't tell the company nothing uh, personal about you you know no credit cards no directions no address nothing like that it's just uh, how many time how many hours you work uh, you you play the game you know uh, how other, maybe how other games you play you know in which stage you, of the game you are you know stuff like that you know in which country are you playing what in which hours in which hours you play stuff like that you know there is no it's not so crazy in, uh, um, um, I'm gonna make it you know it's not gonna they're not gonna take you credit cards or anything so because people find out find out because that's the problem they put us in programs to track that information. They are totally fine with it. But they didn't disclose it. For many games, they didn't disclose it. Now that the people are, are open arms, you know, you can find games like this one. You know? News. Let's go to the news. The first thing the first thing that you see in the Quake Champions uh, news is talking about the Red Shell. It was it, that was June 21, you know. Talking about the red shell, you know? so people understand how they're using it and everything because people are open up. I believe if I go to another, I don't know if these people are following this. No, I don't believe. No, no I find I find the one from 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 Quake Champion but uh, I'm pretty sure other 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 people are taking so I wish wish applaud you know I wish applaud I'm pretty agree that the people from Bethesda I believe yeah is doing it you know so people know what's going on uh, I hope the other companies do it, does it too and talk about it you know because uh, they're supposed to talk about it, you know. The people from Bethesda, they begin to talk about it right away, you know. Uh, so, the other company is supposed to follow suit, to, you know, and talk about it, tell it to the people if they use the red chair or not, you know, and everything, because right now it's a pretty heat, it's a pretty hot uh, uh, issue, you know. A lot of people are not happy. A lot of games are not happy. It was, I was, uh, you know. Uh, maybe you ask me. Maybe you, maybe you ask you. Oh, well, why I'm looking in Steam? Because it's specifically, specifically for Steam. You no, know, it's specifically in the Steam, in the Steam uh, platform that that everything is happening. Which again, I'm totally fine with it. I don't, I don't forbid the use of Rachel or any other programs like that in order in order to, to make a better product in order to make a, if that thing is gonna help to make better games in the future they can continue using it you know but they should they should tell to the people they should tell to the people what's going on so people don't mis, don't mislead and what happened was that a lot of people that, that really know they find out they find out it basically, 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 those games they call those games with their with their pants with their pants down, you know. Hasukita says, "Sorry, I wasn't very talkative tonight, buddy, but thanks for the drop in the knowledge. Didn't know how much about that red chair. Oh, it's red chill. It's red chill like the the." Like uh, the is is red shell like uh, the, the the red shell from from the Mario red shell yeah it's red shell you see like red shell like Mario yeah yeah it's it's, it's good for you guys to 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 go over there red shell that I owe. Rex share diaro let, let me see if I can post it and read about it so you you have a better understanding 
and don't freak out because yeah and don't freak out because this is happening and you should know you know that's you should know about that it is happening and you should know what is that nothing wrong with that I don't see nothing wrong with it you know but the problem was that nobody was disclosing it you know nobody was t talking about it uh, some games got caught red handed you know like oh man what this program is doing in, in my computer what this game is using this you know some people that know how to track those things they say oh man what happened over here you know I, nobody told me about that there is no in the agreements in this game this is no everywhere you know some people follow suit and, and get very angry about it they get very angry there is many many youtube videos about that too you can go to youtube i believe twitch has a lot of video too so you put research in the twitch but it, the problem is a lot of people doesn't tell those things in, in <laughs> In Twitch, people are pretty too occupied in in the in the games that doesn't talk about those things either. You know, yeah. you know, it's kind of difficult to find information like that. Yeah, it's diff. It's it's diff. It's I don't fall, I don't find nothing in Twitch. No, I know, I know a lot of a lot of people that make content. They use Twitch to talks about those things and everything, just like I am doing. But they 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 just put those videos in in other platform because this is more for gaming and have fun. You know, there is no there is no ways to to get that. A lot of, but in, in YouTube, you go YouTube, there is full of videos, people talking about, explaining what the Rachel do, what, you know, all the things, you know, which is pretty good. But you need to, you need to go, guys, to the, to the website and read about, so you know, you know, there's nothing wrong with it. Many websites does it, many websites, as, as I saw you, my website does it too, because I, not because I do it. I don't have the technology behind it to do it. It's because the the ads in my website they do automatically because those are ads by Google. Those are ads by Google and that Google technology they need to use those those tracking, you know, device to in order to get to give you a better experience, you know. Uh, because that that's how they know what kind of products you are interested, you know, and stuff like that. Yeah, people are freaking out. Because a lot of people doesn't know how those technologies are working a hundred percent, you know. They they got the right to, to be what what is this, you know, to be concerned about it. But uh, uh, but everybody is what well, the problem with everybody's open arm is that there a lot of a lot of games are not disclosing are not disclosing these things. No, I'm not disclosing these things. I are making their games and putting on this thing and nobody's talking about the rapture. People find out. People find out. And now everybody is panicking, you know, companies are talking about it. People are talking about it. It is it is something that a lot of people don't like, it, you know, like why you need to wait until everybody knows something to talk about this, this why you need to get caught you know in something because this is that's not a mistake that's not a mistake this is a problem you put over there for some specific reasons you know you should talk about it you should talk about it let me show you something let me show you something again I am not a big company I am not a developer I don't make money with anything I'm doing computers no making no money you know, uh, it, which is uh, which is pretty sad sometimes. You know, because I really want to make a living for everything you do, I do, but it's not easy. Look, this is my website. You know, my website. Look at what it has. You know? It has automatically tells you 
that you are being tracked by those ads over there in the top you know so when you go when you go to the to my blogs or anything it doesn't appear over here because I accept it uh, again did I use cookies so so once you accept it it, it, it doesn't show again I have to I have to uh, clear the browser but I, I'm guaranteed you go by yourself you're gonna see in the bottom this that that little thing over here you see I'm not gonna hit it because again and I wanna I wanna keep it like that to for 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 future examples you know to tell to the people what's going on you know yeah that's that's the thing then if you go to any of those posts inside of the post I got a section that say that say you know the technology report in technology report you know I, I I'm here trying to communicate you know the things in my in my in my programs I'm doing a, a games called it Domino Rising so I explain what are the technologies I'm using you know in my program so people know what they are using when they execute my game you know just disclose the people just dis there is no problem to disclose no? the problem is when you don't disclose all the things you don't disclose the things then people find out that you're using flash or they're using this they don't like none of those programs none of, none of those things are bad cookies are not bad they can be used for bad but they are not bad nothing of those things are bad for you but you need to disclose it so people know what's what's going in the background you know? i really i'm really glad that people are opening their eyes right now you know i'm i'm fighting for those you know ah, you need to disclose you need to do the stuff you know that we got lawyers that work in the field for that things you know i'm kind of glad that the companies now need to disclose their things you know and this is this all of this is easy it just it just take a couple minutes put in your website you know you know put in your website it just took a couple minutes Big companies and try, like Google, I'm telling to you, they use it. You gotta do this. You gotta do that. You know, you gotta disclose. You know, why? Why the little guy? Why the little guys doing it? You big companies that really make the the money. You know, they really, man, that's your livelihood. That's your livelihood. You're not doing it. You know. You need to think about it. Those corporations, those big companies that are making the money, you need to think about it because now you you are a, you are an empire right now. But tomorrow, tomorrow you can be nothing. You know. You don't want. I don't want that. You know. I don't want it. That's why I say thank you to Bethesda to talk about it in the Quay in the Quay Champions thing, Ch Champion News because I really like that game. I don't want that game to disappear. I don't want the game to disappear because somebody uh, uh, decides to sue the Bethesda or decided to sue the game, you know, because they didn't disclose it. But they disclose it right now. They disclose it. They're talking about it. So all the companies supposed to do it, the same thing that they are doing, you know. They're supposed to disclose and talk about the things because the, that's the, the the danger is when you don't disclose. You remember the whole debacle of of, of of uh, content creators, people that, that that used to do videos, you know, they need to disclose if if they have a, a some deals behind it. That's why I I I show you my subscribers every single video. I show you my subscribers, you know, so you know what is my main motivation to make those videos, you know. I show you the people that are hosting my channel, so you know why is my main motivation. You know, it's not the developers. If a developer came to me and tell me, "Hey, I'm gonna give you money so you can play my game," you are the, you are gonna be the first. You're gonna be the first to know because you're gonna have a a, a big sponsor a sponsor uh, signs somewhere in the screen. You know, plus I'm gonna be talking about it. 
You're not gonna be this closer, hundred percent. Otherwise, I'm not gonna be. I'm not gonna be doing it. How so? Gideon says, "All right, buddy. Thanks for the info. Time for me to take off for the night. Good streams. Thanks for doing what you do. Take it easy. But good to be. Have a good night. Oh, thank you for being the stream, How so? Gideon. Thank you for 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 be here. It really helped me. You know, it really helped me to continue forward. It's motivate me and everything." Uh, I really hope, I really hope that you rest well, because you really deserve it, man, you really deserve it, you work a lot, you stream a lot, you know, every day, a lot of, a lot of hours, so you should, you should rest, yeah, it, it make a schedule, so, so you can do all the things you want, you know, uh, see, so you can know, stream a lot, stream one hour every day, at least one hour every day, so, you have time to rest and everything because because dedicated a lot of time in one thing is, is can be dangerous, you know. Uh, but I really I really appreciate it that you came over here and support my streams, which is pretty nice, Mr. Hasugida. Which is pretty nice, Hasugida. Hasugida said thanks, thanks, dude. Good night. Thank you to you, Mr. Hasugida. This stream is not possible. Without you guys, this stream is not possible. Without you guys, you are the ones that shape the gaming community. You know, without you guys, there is no streams. Everything I do, I, I'm doing for you guys right now. This art book, this little breaky art book, is gonna be totally free for you guys. Yeah, this is gonna be something that you can download it for free. You know? If we are gonna be putting pages every single time that every week you know that we are gonna be doing the low breaker thing we are gonna be putting pages and more pages that 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 thing is gonna be big that book is gonna be big you know because we are gonna put a lot of pages you know like I only only the banger we did like a four pages with the banger with this guy is gonna be four pages if we got 18 18 classes 18 characters you know Night classes, 18 characters. So it is a lot, it's gonna have a lot of a lot of drawings. It's gonna have a lot of drawings. Yeah, it's getting it's getting good. It's getting good. Yeah, it's really nice. I really liking it. Let me save it. I am really liking it. Let me see if I can go for the face. Because as I said before, I wanna. I'm not. I'm not gonna go for the hundred percent realism in the face, but something that say there's a guy over there. You know? <laughs> something that say there's a guy over there. Let me put it very big. So this thing is gonna be a lot of a little cringy for a lot of people. No. So I know uh, 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 I am not like a, a professional face guy. I'm trying to do something that looks, you know, they can lose good. Oh no, he's not sad. He's kind of angry, but he's not sad. Let me see if I can copy and paste something. Oh, I'm doing it in the wrong. I'm doing it in the wrong thing. Let me copy. Let me cut it. You see? But because I had that in memory, I can erase it. I can't erase it right now. Without hurt. Without, without hurt the the how they call it I, re, I don't remember the the layer without holding the layer they're supposed to they're supposed to be you know let me put it um, what is the measure lay down yeah let me see if I can oh This is 
something. Oh yeah. Yeah, I was trying not to da to damage the, la the, the 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 layer. And now I I put the mesh lay down. Boom! I got it. Yeah. Now we got to do the the other side. Let's do to the other side. Let's make a flip. Make a flip. How, how do I make a flip? Oh, there is a there is a flip over here. Flip layer or something. Oh, I believe I cannot flip the layers, but I can flip the paste. Yeah, flip horizontal. See? Yeah, maybe professionals are watching say, man, this guy doesn't know how to play. Doesn't know how to work with this. It's working pretty crazy. Yeah, but I'm not trying to be like super crazy, you know. I'm trying to use first thing and trying to teach you something, you know. Teach you something in the ways, in the most simple ways, you know. Most simple ways so you can re review this 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 video and learn something. Uh, another thing is, yeah, look, it's the enforcer. No. Another thing is like. I'm trying to teach you something uh, the most simple ways, you know. Another thing is like I am not the, the professional guy over here. I'm just a, a tinker, tinkering with things, you know. See, so any company want me to hire, that's okay. No, that's okay. I don't, I don't get banned for this. I can do many things. <laughs> I can do a lot of things. Yeah, it's pretty nice, pretty awesome. And available too. I'm available. I am. I am. I'm seeking. I'm seeking jobs right now. Uh, it could be nice, you know, for me to get. Man, I love a job. Let me tell you something. I love. A, I land a job in the in the doing drawings stuff like this. In some place, that is gonna be. That's gonna be a a, a dream job for me. That's gonna be a dream job for me because these things are really, I really like it. You know, I don't do every day, I don't do every day uh, drawing thing. You know, because because I really like to keep a to keep a different uh, keep a you know gaming and. And drawing at the same time, you know, gaming by by writing, you know, I, I really want to have some variety in my in my channel, you know. I don't wanna I don't wanna just do one thing. But but I really wish to have to do only only the drawings because I need to I need to do I need to get better in drawings too. I need to do, get good. No, I need to get good in my drawings too. I I really want I really wanted to be like a better drawing guy, you know. Not drawings, the whole thing, 3D design and everything, you know. I know I I don't know if you knew that I do 3D 3D stuff too, characters and everything. But not like a not like a, the guys that work in the games, you know. But they work. They are pretty beautiful too. I don't know if you see my streets. <laughs> they are beautiful too. The ones for for oh for the for the Domino Rising. Let me show you. The one from my from my games. Oh, I know how my works I. I know how my works I own. Let me see if I can. Yeah, the one from my. You know those characters? It was it was designed by me. You know, so I do my I do my share of of 3D characters too. You know, I know they're not like crazy characters, like uh, high end characters and stuff like that. But they are beautiful. They look good. You know, they look funny. That's what I go for this game I'm doing. You know, it has to be fun. It has to be fun. 
Oh, let me show you something now that we're talking about Domino Rising. Let me see if I can show you something. Yeah, I'm, I'm thinking about going full. Oh, don't tell me. Don't tell me you're gonna update. Yeah, no. No update today. Yeah, because sometimes on real on real engine want to update. We are going full on real papers. We are going and going full on real. And I'm doing this uh announcement over here now that we're talking about uh about the my game, you know, now that we're talking about my game. I'm gonna show you that we are going for Unreal Editor, you know. No more, no more spaghetti code. No more using paying programs, you know, in order to do something. Just I still have to use a lot of programs, a lot of stuff. But with Unreal Engine, I'm gonna be, I'm gonna have the possibilities, people. The possibilities to do everything with one package, you know? Because Unreal, Unreal Tournament do does Unreal Tournament, Unreal Editor. I always talk about Unreal. It's confusing for me because I'm coming from the from the Unreal Tournament, you know? I'm, I'm a Unreal Tournament player, so every time I say Unreal, I believe I'm talking about the game Unreal. You know, it's pretty crazy. Recent levels dominant rising. Yeah, people, you can see we are going full unreal with dominant rising. As you can see, the ladies is is I I, I import a couple of characters already in, into the unreal engine. Pretty easy, by the way. It's not like a, a many developers say like, oh, it's difficult, it's hard. It's not hard at all, it's, it's kind of easy. <laughs> because in realism it's a pretty easy tool to use. You want to learn, you should download it. It's a pretty easy, you know, uh, one of the tables, you know. We, I have to work on that because uh, that table doesn't have the, the, the smooth surface that they needed to put the pieces of. Oh, I believe I deleted it. I, I used to have a piece of domino laid down over there, but I, I believe I, I deleted it. You know? Uh, yeah, man, it's gonna be awesome. We are gonna have domino rising on real. It's gonna be it, it, one of the things that, that is gonna happen is that it's gonna change. You know, domino rising is not gonna be 2D anymore, it's gonna be 3D now. So that is gonna change, you know? That's gonna change for maybe a lot of people that want it. See something in the boot? Oh yeah, they, they look you look in the in the in the other game you cannot see like the the, the texture and everything, but in real turn in real engine you can see the texture of the you know those little textures everything which is pretty nice. You know, in the shade the shade is pretty beautiful. You can see like the sun and everything. You get you can see like a Realistic shadows, you know, pretty good shadows, man. Look, pretty, pretty good shadows. Unreal Engine is, is, is a pretty nice uh, engine, game engine. Yeah. I just have to learn how to program Unreal Engine, which is which is not gonna be difficult for me either because I'm a programmer already. So it's the same thing. Si you're a programmer, every single language you use is almost the same. It's no, it's no, it's no big deal. Yeah, and put the time into it. It's gonna be f it's, it's gonna be faster now. It's gonna be faster for me to to program and to do things uh, for in, in Unreal Engine because Unreal Engine uh, is developed is developed to be easy to understand. No, it's not it's not developed to to be crazy and that and it is it's, it's developed to be easy to understand. So it's gonna be. It's gonna be nice, you know. It's gonna be nice. Let me close it because it takes a lot of memories. Yeah, it's gonna be nice. the The game is gonna change. It's not gonna be 2D anymore. It's gonna be 3D now. 
which is maybe it's gonna upset how many people that you know I wanted this game to be 2D like uh, in the browser when yeah because in the beginning we say we're gonna do it was like that we was developing it for the for the browser you know we were developing for the browser but let me tell you son let me tell you son let me tell you no let me show you son because I don't really like to tell you by you know I want you to show you because the gaming community in general long time ago you know everybody everybody have the commitment you know it makes the commitment to show the people stuff talk less and show more you know talk less and show more that's why people doesn't like song e3 2018 conference that happens you know they, they just put trailers after trailers you know it didn't show anything just crazy stuff you know people didn't like it people didn't like it. mr solo mr solo naep Welcome to the streams, Solana. Welcome to the streams. I break something over here. Welcome to the streams, Solana. Enjoy your stay. Thank you for coming to the stream. I really appreciate it. Oh, Mr. Seg with Dread 95. Welcome to the stream. Mr. Seg with Dread 95. Welcome to the streams. Yeah. People, this is this is what I'm trying to, to show you. I can I can I can do this game. For Firefox, Chrome, Edge, you know, desktop. I can do this game for device manager. You can you can manage different devices. iOS, you know, Firefox, you know, Chrome. So if you want this game to be, you know, if you want this game to be in 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 desktop. In, in browser like I, like I was trying to do in the beginning yeah it could happen because Unreal Engine it says everything it says everything for those devices you know you know I'm not gonna show you I'm not gonna render this in, in those devices because I don't want I don't want to break anything because I'm still learning but this is this is this is what this is what's gonna happen you know look I mean, Horizon is going 3D, full 3D. Solanae, Solanae, say hey, ba. Say with, say with Dreadnought. If I say howdy, Solanae, say how's it going? Say with Dreadnought. Say with Dreadnought. If I say, but God is kickstarting this game. Yeah, we. I'm not kickstarting it because I'm not gonna take money for it. But I'm showing to the people how my game they are developing in this in this channel, Dominion Rising is gonna be now using the power of Unreal Engine, you know? So it's gonna be it's gonna be nice man. It's not gonna be like 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 the beginning. That used to be like a 2D only. It's gonna be full it's gonna be full 3D. It's gonna continue being free to play, you know. So you just download it and everything. It's it's not gonna be it's not gonna be difficult for nobody, you know. It's gonna be pretty awesome. So we're it looks great. One year will be oh it's gonna be domino game. It's gonna be a domino game. That you're gonna be able to play against people, you know, around the world and everything. The genre is more it's gonna be more like a RPG, you know? so you know you have a, a pretty nice idea it's gonna be like an RPG but it's gonna be about dominoes so on I always wanted to learn how to do 3d smacks but never got passion for it so on I said will it be on Steam oh yeah I'm, I'm, I'm trying I'm gonna be trying to see if we can do if we can put it on Steam, but uh, it's gonna be available in my website, you know, in my in my own website. But uh, but the the bottom the, the goal is to be in the Steam, you know, it's because games that that make it to Steam, 
Yeah, doing better. Yeah, doing better. Yeah, today we were we were working with a. I don't know if it's you know. So now I will check it out when it comes up. Second so ninety five says awesome. I love it. Yeah, yeah, man. I have four years working in that game, but it was uh, in a different direction. Let me see if I can show you my my website again. You know, it was in a different direction. As you can see, I'm being like a many years, many years from 2000. From 2000, um, let me see, 2017, 2012. From 2012, like six year working in this game. You know, always doing art for the game and everything. You know, uh, characters that are gonna be. In the game, they go. He's gonna have a lot of characters, you know. I just working with those five, but I, we, I got more characters, you know. I, I got more characters and everything. It's, it's gonna be awesome. Yeah, this is one of the dominoes pieces. The dominoes pieces that we using. It's gonna be totally different, <laughs> totally different at what we at what we used to to see. You know, it's gonna be pretty innovative too. It's not gonna be something that that you see everywhere. It's gonna be pretty unique. You know, this is the character stuff with the pieces and everything. It's gonna be totally different. It's not gonna be because Domino games I always like at the same. You know, for people that like to play Domino games, it's like I always the same for them. Look at, look at, this is some examples of the dominoes pieces that we're doing in the game. You see? It's gonna be awesome. This is another sample of the game, of the pieces of the game. Yeah? Got this too. Yeah. We got this this one the, the linear ones. No? I show you to everybody just you know because I really want to people to get ideas too. I, I improve improve into into the idea too. Solonet said, why is called Domino Rising? Lol. So with 95 says, Domino's attacking humans. Solonet says, I never was good at Domino's. So with 95 says, same. Solonet says, I play a lot of chess though. So, so with 95 says, Solonet, are you good? <laughs> yeah, the... the let me tell you, uh, when I begin this game, I was thinking about doing it, the chess, doing a chess game. As that, that was the that was the original idea. But because I am not good in chess, and chess could be chess, chess could be pretty crazy, you know. Some people t believe, maybe believe, oh no, you only have to do the pieces that move in this way, in this way. No, 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 no. no. So many too, so many things you have to do. In the background to make a chess game work properly, you know. I don't have the expertise. It's gonna be very crazy. I have to do the research. I said, let me do something simple, you know. Let me do something simple to begin. But it's not gonna be a hundred percent simple, you know. It's gonna have. I gonna. It's gonna be innovative. This is one of the the, the, the tablets with the piece, little pieces. It's gonna be something different but it's gonna be simple you know I believe this is the video because it's working the game is working and everything I'm trying to look for a video you can see how how it looks like the gameplay you know so I say man I'm gonna do 
the domino game, but it has to be something different in the market. Why is called Domino Rising? Because it's gonna be a rising version, you know, a, a, a most innovative version of Domino. This is for people playing together, you know, a, a, online. But it gets too sl too too slow. As you can see, it gets too slow. That's why I'm changing to the Unreal Engine because I, I'm having so many problems with with making a server that that is fast with four people, you know. Because I, I'm trying to make to put more than four people. I'm trying to put like a hundred people in one server, something like that, or many, or maybe more, you know. This is just with four people. Look at how 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 slow it is, you know. It's too slow for with four people. So, it is something wrong in the server, or is something wrong that I'm doing that I can't figure it out. I can't figure it out. So I, I'm gonna go full Unreal because Unreal tournament. That you got Epic Games company, you know that it helps you all the time. By the way, I am not new. I am not new in Unreal Engine, you know. And I have my I have my time on Real Engine too, so I know those people in, in Epic Games, the people that help you, they help you go, go, go forward and everything. They got a lot of support over there, a lot of, of materials, you know, that you can learn and everything. It is pretty, it is pretty nice. So now I say I am an average at chess. I went to the chess school as a kid. Oh, that's pretty nice. You went to a school? Wow, but you you know a lot. You say average, bro. You say average, bro. Maybe you know a lot. Yeah, I don't I don't know. A chess for me is always complicated. Dominos is more like more relaxed, man, less less a struggle. Chess is, is pretty hardcore for me, you know. I always I always die like in the I always people always check checkmate to me all the time like I uh, you know I can see that I can see the thing is it's pretty difficult for me so when I said boot drop it when I turn it when I turn it 15 16 or so go interesting other things oh yeah that happens that happens that happens chess is pretty serious game it's a pretty serious game uh, I don't I, I always see that I always see that you know in my in my town in my town there was a lot of people like that that he was he was into it all the time they was they were doing playing playing every day they belong to a chess club you know to play every day then suddenly one day they stopped playing they stopped playing because it's it's almost I don't I don't I don't blame them chess is almost the same thing every time you know it is you need to be a uh, I don't know man you need to be like a a pretty deep person in order to, to be doing it for, for long you know like those people that get professional it has like a 40 years playing chess like a for real man like what <laughs> you know like a, you need to be like a some special kind of person to 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 keep playing chess for many years you know like what you know I don't know it has to be the people around you you know they have you know you need to be you need to have people around you to motivate you to continue forward to and stuff like that as you can see I'm not gonna continue showing that because it could be boring too I understand yeah uh, but that's 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 the idea you know that's the idea and that game is that game that you saw in the video is totally running in in the browser internet browser and running it's a two two dimensional game but now with the unreal engine you, it's gonna be full 3d the cities are the places that you you can go is gonna be full 3d because it's gonna have cities and everything it's gonna be awesome. It's gonna be awesome. Yeah. Well, people, I'm gonna say thank you to the people that was in the stream today. 
Si you just came in, I, I really highly recommend it. I really highly recommend that you watch the, the video again so you you can learn one thing or two, you know. We talk a lot about a lot of a lot of things. We talk about the, the problem with the red shell. You know, the a lot of games are having, a lot of companies are having. Uh, we talk uh, a lot of many, many, many things. It was pretty nice today. See what doing refers? I am a thirty masochist. <laughs> oh Tetris is a pretty nice game. Right now they they, they there is so many Tetris speed runner says solo solo nine says Tetris speed runner. Kappa. Yeah right now Tetris is being is pretty good because now we got many different so Tetris. Many different versions of Tetris. It's pretty entertaining. Tetris is always has been a pretty good game man. A pretty good game. Yeah. Yeah, people, don't forget to come in tomorrow. Tomorrow we are going to have another stream. Tomorrow we are going to be playing Low Breakers again. It's going to be a nice stream of Low Breakers. So the nice say Tetris is a good time killer. Yeah. Yeah, good time killer. It, 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 it makes you fast, too. It makes you take decisions in, in, in you know, fast. In pretty, you know, take good decisions in 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 no time, which is very good. It's something that a lot of people need, you know, including me. It really, it really, Tetris is really a, a pretty awesome game. That's why that's why I get a lot of a lot of a lot of awards and everything because that that game is pretty awesome. Say with Renner, if I say, you seen the Tetris game review in E3 or oh, no? Oh, they got new. Oh, yeah, I, be, I believe that they, 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 they talk about a new game, a new Tetris game. Yeah, I believe I, the Tetris, yeah, Tetris effect. Yeah, I believe. Let me see I can put over here. Yeah, they, they, they were talking about it. Uh, now that I remember. Look, E3 2018, that's a trailer. Oh, really? So the knife said, is this a Mass Effect spin-off? <laughs> Baby. <laughs> Baby, is that a spin-off from Mass Effect? Nobody knows. <laughs> Solonaed is following. Thank you for the follow, Mr. Solonaed. Thank you for the follow. I really appreciate it, Solonaed. I'm going to tell you that we got a giveaway in August 2. August 2, we got a giveaway. And the only thing you have to do in order to participate in the giveaways, now that you can fo that you are following, man, is first step, follow. Second step, watch the streams. That's it. You watch the streams. You get your name in the leaderboards. Over here in the leaderboards. Let me see. Over here in the leaderboards, you know, if you keep your name from from now until August two, you're gonna get the loot, you know. Remember that ten people, ten people are gonna get the loot. I'm gonna show you the loot after the trailer, so you know what I'm talking about. Thank you for the follow. Yeah, keep it, keep keep coming and keep making, um, keep uh, keep earning, you know, I keep earning loot, which is pretty good. I, I own for the loot. Man, that Tetris is going to be difficult to, to play. Maybe I'm not understanding nothing. For reals. <laughs> I know it's a trailer, but they went bonkers with, uh, with many things. They had to show gameplay. <laughs> Seven Drenary Fies says lol Look, Seven Drenary is getting the loot, look. He's getting the loot, he's in he's in the leaderboard. Keep it all, Seven Drenary Fies. You get in the loot too. Keep it keep it your name in the leaderboards, you're gonna get the loot in, in August too. Seven Drenary Fies says I I see such image on weed. <laughs> yeah, that's a does too many graphics. Wow, it's like that? It's gonna look like that? It's gonna be crazy. 
There is no some kind of or oh, look like it looks like uh, this is a uh, a gameplay. Let me see if I can put a gameplay. Yeah, let me see if I can. Oh, it's the same. Let me see if that. Let me wait for the for the the yeah, the thing. Oh, why so little? That score is too little. Oh, beautiful colors, nice, nice effects. But it's, it's, it's too little, the square is too little. So it's safe for them to put those, those graphics outside. They put the little the little square of it in the middle like that. I really appreciate to see they make it a little bit bigger because it looks so so little. So now I say this this should be in BR. Oh, is it is it BR? My bad. Oh, it's in BR too. Oh, that's why they have the little square in the middle. It to those space. Oh, because it's TBR. You see, like a too many space from here to there. Like a too many space over here. Too many space over there. Oh yeah, that that's why maybe that's why that's why it's like that because maybe it's VR. Yeah, VR gameplay. Look, VR gameplay. It says VR gameplay. Oh, they should have to. They should have to do like some version for for normal people. For normal screens. Yeah. So then I say, ah, screens too small. Yeah. I didn't. I didn't. I didn't was. I wasn't reading over here. In the bottom. So. I hope they, they got like a different teams, you know, different pieces and different different layout because this one is like a marine water kind of thing. It's gonna be crazy. It's gonna be it's gonna be pretty crazy, you know. So, Seven twenty five says you can adjust it. Oh, interesting. Yeah, that's pretty not awesome. I'm not gonna do the whole thing. It's pretty. It's pretty big. It's pretty. It's pretty thing. In and I have to go to. Yeah. I'm gonna say thank you, people. Thank you to the people that was in the streams, which is pretty nice. I'm gonna say thank you to Mr. House Guido for being the streams. You know, it was pretty nice, pretty awesome, Mr. House Guido. You came to the streams pretty early. I really appreciate it. I'm gonna say thank you to Sol Solonaet for being the stream. Thank you for being the stream, Mr. Solo Night. It was pretty nice, pretty awesome. Thank you for the follow too. I really appreciate it. I wanna say thank you to Say with Drain 95. Say with Drain 95. Thank you for being the stream. I really appreciate it too. Solo Night says thank you for the stream. Bye. See ya. See ya, Mr. Solo Night. Remember Solo Night. Uh, watch the stream so you can get the loot. Just 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 like Say with Drain 95 is gonna get the loot. Let me tell you. Let me show you the loot. Don't go anywhere. Let me show you the loot. No, watching the streams. You get you get your name in the leaderboards. You keep it. You keep it. Your name in the leaderboards until August two. You get to choose a twenty-five Steam gift card or a twenty-five PayPal donation. You know it's gonna it's gonna pretty it's gonna be pretty nice because ten people, ten people are gonna get the loot. All these people in the in the in the leaderboard, all those people over here in the leaderboard are gonna get the loot. So, so there is a lot of opportunities, you guys, for to get the loot. You know, with the loot, you can you can buy a lot of games, a lot of games. Indie games, those little indie games, you know, that maybe you don't wanna buy. Yeah, the booty. <laughs> so if I, you know, those those little games that maybe you're not gonna buy, that's that's your opportunity. You know. That you opportunity to buy twenty five dollars of of games, you know, or maybe or maybe you are saving for for some of the triple A man triple A games are pretty expensive. Maybe you are saving for triple A game, 
It's a little help, you know, it's a little help so you can get your games. So, Redray95 says, I need only buy. I will pass on the loot. Oh, thank you, Mr. Say 95 Thank you, thank you. It really makes me feel better. It really make, make, makes me feel important. So, Naif, I will get a loot. Oh, the loot. Oh, you just, just only, only have to watch my streams, you know, from 2 a.m. to 4 a.m. It's time. I wear every day. Tomorrow? Don't forget coming tomorrow. Tomorrow is gonna be low breakers. Tomorrow is gonna be low breakers, man. Yeah, I'm gonna say thank you to the people that subscribe to my channel. You know, those people that came to my channel subscribe. Pretty nice. They're giving me pretty nice help. I'm gonna say thank you to Mr. Cole Ninja Gaming for the sub. I really appreciate it. You know, that you give me the support. You know, Mr. Mr. Cole Ninja Game, give me the support and the motivation to continue forward. I really helps. It really helps me to continue. You know, I wanna say thank you to Mr. Hasukita. Thank you for the sub. Thank you for everything you do, Mr. Hasukita. Thank you for motivating me to continue forward and everything. It is pretty nice, pretty awesome. I really appreciate it, Mr. Mr. Hasukita. I wanna say thank you to Mr. Depisaz. Mr. Depisaz, it's really nice, Mr. Depisaz. You subscribe to my channel, you know. It really helps to continue forward. It is pretty nice, you know. Tomorrow, I, I really want to Mr. Depisa and Code Ninja Gaming to come in tomorrow too, because they got many days, many days not coming. I'm gonna say thank you to the people that are hosting my stream. No, I'm gonna say thank you to Mr. Flying Soda for hosting my stream. It's pretty nice, pretty awesome. Spray the water on my channel, bring more people to the streams. It is pretty awesome, man. I'm gonna say thank you to House of Guido for hosting my stream today. It was pretty nice. He was in the chat today, has a good one too. By the way, he was here talking to me about everything. It is pretty nice. Those, crea those creative uh, streams are pretty chill. As are pretty chill, chill, you know. Not a lot of craziness and everything, but we talk a lot of stuff. You should never miss out my streams because we we're talking a lot of stuff. Just, just as, as you saw with the Tetris effect kind of thing, you know. I want to say thank you to the Money Kitty Jaja, the Money Kitty Jaja for being my streams. Pretty nice, pretty awesome. It's the Money Kitty Jaja. I really appreciate it, you know, that you hosted my stream. Pretty nice. I want to say thank you to Miss First Justice. Miss First Justice. What is Miss First Justice? Miss First Justice always, I always, oh, it's over here. Yeah. Mr. Justice, thank you for the host. Mr. Uh, Justice is always difficult for me to find it, but I find it. Mr. Justice, thank you for the for for the host. I really appreciate it, Mr. Justice. It, it really it really helps me to continue forward. It is very nice. Thank you for the host. I want to say thank you to Mr. Cowdy Joker. Cowdy Joker, thank you for the host. Thank you for everything you do, Mr. Cowdy Jokers. No, thank you for spreading the word about my channel, bringing more people to the streams. People, so you know why? Why did so you ask him why I I, I always begin with Cody Joker, with House of Gideon? I'm I'm going for the list, for the list over here, you know, for the people that is in the list first, because those are the guys that that are coming every that every time. Oh, thank you for the host, Mr. Buck, Mr. Buck Cohen. Thank you for the host. I really appreciate it. Let me let me look for the stupid bacon and tap. Oh, this is station C. Stupid bacon is over here. Yeah, thank you for the host, Mr. Stupid Bacon. I really appreciate it. Stupid Bacon, you hosting my stream, you know? Spraying the water on my channel, bringing more people to the stream. It is pretty nice, pretty awesome, Mr. Stupid Bacon. Looking forward to see you. Oh, he's over here. Stupid Bacon, hello, bye. Welcome to the stream, Mr. Stupid Bacon. Welcome to the, to the streams. Hello, bye. Hello, Stupid Bacon. How, how are you? I, I hope you, you're feeling good. Yeah, I'm gonna say thank you to Mr. Tux. Mr. Mr. Tux, that is hosting my stream too. Thank you for the host, Mr. Tux. Thank you for everything you do. I really appreciate it, Mr. Tux. It really helps me to, to continue forward. So we're trying to say, hey, 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 Super so Connor says, I tried going to sleep hours ago, but I couldn't get asleep. Oh, really, man? Why, why, why you worry about it? Maybe you worry about something. Did you drink coffee? Coca-Cola? Soda? Ice cream, maybe? Those are the things. Those, those things can take you, take, 
Think you slip out. I hope, I hope, I hope you're feeling good. Because that, that's pretty bad when you, you wanna, you wanna sleep but you cannot sleep, man. That's, that's pretty crazy. I don't like it, man. When that happens to me, I don't like it. It's the book on No, it's definitely worry about things, but this is nothing, man. That is anyone concerned but mine. Oh, man. Super corny, and I'm gonna tell you, Super corny, that anything that can happen that you you believe we can help, you know, don't don't forget, you know, don't forget to tell me, because that's what we're here to to support each other and to continue forward, Mr. Stupid Bacconi, you know. That's why we are here. So don't forget, man. You, this is not just a stream. This is a community of friends, you know. We are here to to help each other to continue forward and everything so don't don't hesitate don't hesitate Mr. Stupid Bacani yeah I'm gonna say thank you to Mr. AC80 thank you for the host thank you for everything you do Mr. AC80 really appreciate it you know that you spread the word about my channel bringing more people to the streams I'm gonna say thank you to Code Ninja Gaming Code Ninja Gaming Thank you for the host, thank you for everything you do, Mr. Cold Ninja Gaming. I'm gonna say something to Cold Ninja Gaming that it really, really is, uh, it really is, I'm, I'm worried about Cold Ninja Gaming that he's not coming to the stream. He's not in the, he's not in the leaderboards anymore. So you are in the risk to, to, are in the risk to not get the loot in August too. It's still a lot of time, like I'm one, one, one month, one whole month. Yeah, the, the whole month of July, you know? So you guys still time it's called Ninja Gaming to to come back to the leaderboards. You are now out for a lot of a lot of a lot of points, just a few points. Stupid Bocconi says, I am actually stepping away from Twitch and Discord for a while. I left most Discord servers. I will still answer pings and, and direct message. I will still stream. So maybe less consistently, I will still stop by strings, who likely for less time or not as often. Just need to step away somehow for a breather, for a breather, until I get some in real life stuff settled. Oh yeah, yeah, that's that's pretty nice. That's that's pretty nice. Yeah, you got you got so many times streaming and dealing with the community that you. It's, it's really helpful you yeah, to to stop a little bit you know but just try to be adjust a little bit you know don't don't go anywhere man because uh, once once a, I believe once a person begin to stream it has to has to go for it you know if you are a person that that really helps a lot of people really helps a lot of people so try not to go far away Mr. Stupid Bacani we need you we need you Stupid Bacani hey, streaming is hard streaming is hard that's why that's why a lot of people need to stop for a while because it, it's, it's not oh yeah Stupid Bacani say what if I say be safe dude Stupid Bacani says yeah I am not stopping Cold turkey. <laughs> I am just cutting back. Yeah, yeah. It's important sometimes to to make a pause. Uh, it happens to me a while, like a couple of weeks, a while uh, uh, that I had to stop like a one whole week. One whole week I had to take a, a break because I was getting so many problems in real life, you know with mornings and everything say man I had to stop this a little while think thinking what I'm gonna do and come back and come back to streams yeah still but can I say I know but women by certain are in real life problems that require a great a great deal of attention this prevent me from devoting as much time to communities and you just over overwhelmed oh yeah you got you got a lot of stuff to do you know because you you, you teach people. 
just the teaching the teaching aspect of your communities by the way people so you can follow Mr. Bacconi it could be nice because this guy so you want to learn stuff this is the guy for you guys Mr. Sewe 295 and Sewe Annette this is the guy to, to 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 learn stuff because he he's always teaching to the people how to stream better how to use Discord how to use Twitch you know so you should follow him so when he's available just go for it man you're not gonna find another other resources over here in Twitch like that like me, Mr. Stupid Bacani yeah man you you I, I, I understand you man you you do many things only with the discord the teaching things in the discord it's a lot of stuff it's a lot of stuff a lot of information all, all of that some I'm gonna I'm gonna tell you something you know because I'm a user of, of your stuff sometimes I believe that there is it's like a computer that does everything you know but no it's, it's a person it's a person behind it feels like it looks like a it's a lot of stuff automatically over there no it's a person write it down figure it down with stuff so we can learn new stuff stupid what can I say I just tried to type up and put a variety of resources together on my discord to help people out and then I work on various other communities that serve different purposes such as getting people to feel it quickly oh really oh like 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 the dog 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 guy right yeah this is pretty nice man this is pretty nice yeah it's too much it's too much it's, it's, it's a lot of work it's a lot of work especially when, when you are when you are like in two three three or four communities it's a lot of work. one community is, is too much three or four is 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 is, is, is crazy yeah Stupid Bacani, yes, the dog, the dog is a woman who runs for dog sex. Yeah, yeah, I know about. I, I'm, I'm follow all those communities. Um, the me, I'm, the problem with me on Discord is time. Like I, I got Facebook, I got Twitter, and now I'm trying pretty hard to introduce Discord in my life, but it's still, still pretty crazy. To be becoming but she likewise overwhelmed by a lot of I, I real life at the moment. We have similar problems since we we are getting a place together. Once certain other problems get resolved. Oh you talk you talk you talk you you told me about that the new place. Yeah. Only only trying to get a new place is, is pretty hard. It is pretty high. I understand, man. Well, I'm gonna tell you, Mr. Stupid Bacconi, whatever you have to do in order to, to 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 go through all the things you have to do, do it. Uh, don't forget, you are not alone, Stupid Bacconi. You are not alone. You know, uh, you uh, you got, you got me over here. Anything that you can tell me, uh, that you believe I can help you, just go for it. You know. So don't don't believe that you are doing this. The people are just just faces. No way. You are not alone, Mr. Stupid Bacconi. So don't hesitate to reach out. You know, don't hesitate to reach out. That's why I like about from Twitch that we 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 can get together. You know, and resolve problems. Mr. Bacconi, we have similar problems. Mr. Bacconi, yeah, I hope the gar the garage can fix my car. <laughs> oh, the oh, you 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 send you 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 see you you you're talking about the mechanical guy, the mechanic guy, the mechanic. So we're doing the say baby steps. Yeah, stupid Bacon and says, oh, of course, the only mental, emotional difficulty and inspiration and things on a more intimate level. So while I appreciate the offer, I think I will manage on my own, low. Yeah, 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 man. But yeah, that's that's the only thing that I want to know to, to to tell you. You know, we are here together for a reason. 
nothing nothing in life happens in a crazy way no we are all here for a reason I'm gonna say thank you to uh, st uh, station six thank you for the host Mr. station six thank you for the host thank you for everything you do I really appreciate it it is a really nice I'm gonna say thank you to Mr. Lashai. Thank you for the host. Thank you for spreading the word about my channel, Mr. Lashai. You know, it really motivates me to continue forward. You know, it is pretty nice, pretty awesome. I'm gonna say thank you to See with Red 95. See with Red 95. Thank you for the host. Thank you for everything you do. I really appreciate it, Mr. See with Red 95. That you host my stream, spread the word about my channel, bring more people to the streams, which is always, always good. I really appreciate it, Mr. Seth with Dread 95. Yeah, I believe. Oh, I'm gonna say thank you to Mr. Eco all day. Eco all day, thank you for the host, thank you for everything you do, Mr. Eco all day. I really appreciate it. It's really nice that Mr. Eco all day is hosting my stream, spread the word about my channel, bring more people to the streams. Which is pretty nice. Yeah, let me see. There's a lot of people here that is not hosting my stream. Yeah, that's pretty nice. Yeah, all those people, all the people that was hosting my stream. Pretty nice people that come into my stream too. You know, talk to me, have fun, and everything. You can follow those guys. 100% recommended by me. You know, you can follow all those guys. It's pretty good. Those are the kind of people. Those are the kind of people that if you support them, they support you. So you don't have nothing to lose. Yeah, nothing to lose. Hundred percent recommend. Yeah, today the the character of the Enforcer for Love Breakers it was pretty pretty nice. I really like it. I'm happy with the results. We, I believe, we're gonna continue, yeah, because we have to do the, the class, the class thing for the cl class. It's gonna be in the ne in the next stream, maybe the next Wednesday. No, we are gonna continue with this class. I really like it in the way it looks. No. So we dress. So we don't if I said never go intimate. <laughs> so Bacon and emotions are complicated, lol. Emotions are the things are the more complicated complicated things. Emotions. There are movies talking about that. Movies, whole movies. It's pretty complicated. There are books writing about emotions. This is the most complicated. Why people do the things that they do all the time? Why the people fight each other? Why the people love each other? This is all I had to do with emotions, you know. So it's a, it's a, it's a, it's something that we need to, we need to understand. You know, we need to learn how to understand it so we can be better every day. Yeah, people. People, I, I say sorry for the people that just came into to the stream. <laughs> so what do I find? Say, is it We are animal. I'm gonna say sorry, but it's it's time for me to go. It's getting late. Uh, today is, is gonna be a, a day that I have to go to the work. You know, I I couldn't skip it like like yesterday. I can't skip it today. I have to go to work. I had to to do the things that required me to to survive to continue forward. You know, it was a pretty nice stream today. It was a pretty nice stream today. Uh, I, don't forget to come in tomorrow. Tomorrow is gonna be gameplay, you know? It's gonna be low breakers streams, which is gonna be pretty awesome. Super Connors, oh, well, have a good day at work, man. Oh, thank you, Mr. Super Connors. Thank you. I really appreciate it. Yeah. I really appreciate it. Yeah, people. Uh, don't forget to come tomorrow. Don't forget to follow me. Remember the more the more the more you watch my stream, the more points you get for the leaderboard. So in August two, you can get the loot. Well, people, see you tomorrow. Um, 
Thank you for everything you do. Bye bye.